what will we say is the reason for the success the last two, three months for the New York Mets? Lindor's uh, improved play. I, I look. I, there's a lot that goes into. It. I, don't, I don't think it's. I don't think it's as simple as saying Lindor playing at an MVP level is the only reason why they turned the corner. But I mean, it's pretty incredible. If this was happening under our nose. We've done about 50 shows between the start of baseball season and now. And we've never talked about it, and they've been quiet. And, and, and me, I, I, I haven't brought it up on purpose because I know the Mets. And the second you say something good about them. They find a way to break your heart. They find a way to do something stupid. So I've been purposely just not paying attention. Um, it, I, and out of the corner of my eye, just watching. And to see what they've done with the pitching staff, I think that's the real surprise, right? It, it was like this confidence just started to spread around the team. And this, this can happen in sports where one guy gets hot, right? One guy starts to believe, and it starts to permeate throughout the entire team. And all of a sudden, guys are playing over their heads. Uh, Manaya is, is pitching at a, at a Cy Young level. All of a sudden, David Peterson, it, it looks unhittable some nights, right? These things start to happen. It, 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 the confidence is contagious with the ball club. And, and the manager does a great job. A credit credit to him. And I know he came from the Yankees, and maybe the Yankees should have kept them, right? But, you know, he he does a phenomenal job with the rotation, with the with, with moving moving Lindor to the to, to lead off, right? Something that Buck Walter and the guys before couldn't even figure out. He deserves a lot of credit for the way this team is playing, the way they're operating like a well-oiled machine, getting Edwin Diaz back on track when it looked like early this season we we lost him and he was going to be a shell of himself, right, which is very New York Metsian. Like, it's a very New York Mets thing to happen to get a high-priced free agent and for him to come here and play like garbage. Jason Bay, Robinson Cano, I can name it all. I mean, Cano may have been a trade, but whatever. So the moral of the story is they deserve a lot of credit, man. They've done a phenomenal job piecing together a really, really good season out of a, out of a team that no one expected this from. When you lost, you know, you know, Ver, you know, Ver, you struck out on Verlin there, you struck out on Scherzer. And by the way, they won those trades. They won those trades. They did a phenomenal job. I mean, uh, getting Acuna, who part as a part of one of those deals, I believe he was a part of the Verlander deal. I can't really remember, uh, or it might have been the Texas Texas deal, the the Scherzer deal. But regardless, he comes over. And now he, he he's up and he's hitting home runs and three three or four home runs in his first couple of bats. He has a great glove. He ain't going back. He he knew when he came up. He ain't going back. Acuna Acuna is special, um, and, and he's one of many special uh, prospects that were involved with those trades. So not only are you playing well right now, but regardless of what happens with this wild card race and whether they lose to the Rays or they win and they get in, you have a bright future. Now you, your fan base is energized. There's something to believe in moving forward, which is which is, which is special uh, for the team. So they deserve a lot of credit. Um, and, and in all seriousness, as a Mets fan, I, I'm not disappointed one way or the other, whether they get in and they make some noise or they get in and they get bounced or they don't get in. It don't matter to me. It don't matter to me because they far exceeded expectations and they deserve some credit for that. Really, they do. Cohen and all them guys deserve credit. Uh, hopefully Cohen ain't involved with the Diddy case and all that. And you can stick around to see us go get back to the top. But. All in all, all in all, it's been fun. It's been fun to watch them.